everyone, what is up and welcome to the channel. Right now in this video we are going to discuss a new season 11 beta coming out towards the end of this month and I know already discussing season 11 news when season 10 just came out kind of crazy but we're gonna do it anyways now first you guys before we do hop into this video i do want to say i am giving away five season 10 battle passes on the channel and the giveaway does come to a close in just a few days if you do want to enter all you got to do is be a subscriber on the channel and have post notifications turned on then head down below into the description click on the first link label as battle pass giveaway and fill in the required information on the entry form and it's as simple as that. Without the way, let's hop into the video. So this new test server is going to feature a lot of new things regarding Undead Siege. And I do want to say the test server is estimated to come out towards the end of November. And this is for the Chinese version of the game. But the global test server is estimated to come out around the same time as well. Just like last time. So let's read about this new content for the test server. In the siege mode, the first change the friends can feel is that the battlefield is here. In the experience server test, the battlefield of siege or mutation will be transferred from the border to black battlefield. So essentially, undead siege is gonna go from isolated to the blackout map. So undead siege will now be on the blackout map. Then they say, and in this mode, the game will also increase the difficulty of purgatory with a mild rogue mechanism. The combat experience of your friends will be more random and more challenging. That is in regards to the new difficulty known as the hell mode. They also say there will also be new daytime missions waiting for you to unlock. Now over here we can see that new mode. That is going to be the new difficulty known as Hell Mode. I'm sure this is going to be pretty damn difficult. Then they say in addition during the battle, the game also upgraded the gun battle and tower defense experience. Weapon enhancement machines have been added to the game and ultimate skills can be used. That is in regards to the Pack-a-Punch machine being added to Undead Siege in Season 11. Now I have a feeling the Pack-a-Punch machine being added into the game is going to be the same way it works in the Chinese version of the game. And that is when you pack a punch your gun or upgrade your gun, it increases damage by 50%. It also increases the mag size as well as the fire rate by about 10%. And also you can pack a punch your gun a total of 10 times. They also say ultimate weapons such as Tempest and Ray Gun will also be added to the game. So the Ray Gun is finally coming to Undead Siege, let's go. As well as the Tempest, the Sparrow and the Vortex takes operator skills are also coming to Undead Siege. They also say the tower parts, you can use eight new defense towers and you guys can see all of those new towers over here, those new turrets over here, as well as 10 new talents to choose for your combat style. And you guys can see those new talents over here as well. So, okay, that is a bunch of new features and changes for Undead Siege in season 11 and we'll be able to try out this stuff in the brand new season 11 beta coming out towards the end of this month. Now let's discuss the next thing. They say of course there are new gameplays that cannot be missed. For example, Call of Duty Mobile Games has always favored the winter theme. So perhaps you are going to have like a Christmas winter theme in season 11. In this experience server, you can also experience game content related to winter. In the snowy atmosphere of falling snow, players use snowballs to attack each other and create a different combat experience by picking up random item boxes. Collect snowballs and underneath colored eggs, build snowmen, play snowball fights and experience a different winter experience. In the game, the snowman will gradually unlock random appearances based on the current faction points, more novel styles, are waiting for your discovery. So if you didn't know, well now you do know, in season 11 we are gonna have a new mode known as Snowball Fight, and that sounds like a ton of fun to me. Now anyway guys, that is gonna be all the new news for today's video regarding season 11's new beta, expected to be coming out towards the end of this month. So anyway guys, thank you so much for watching the video. I hope all of you did enjoy it and found it helpful as well. But for now, that's gonna be all from me and have a great day. What's squally out and cheers. Bye.